In this video, let us see how to install Ubuntu in your Windows machine. So, step number one: open Microsoft Store. So, in the search window, search for Ubuntu. So, you can see here Ubuntu 20.04.4 LTS. This is the latest version which is present. So, click on this one. Click on Get. So, this particular software is getting downloaded. Now the software is getting installed. Okay, it is done. Click on open. So if you click on open, you can see one of the error message here. The window subsystem for Linux optional component is not enabled. Means to overcome this error, we need to enable developer settings. So for that, go to settings. Here, click on update and security. Click on developers. Now here you need to enable this particular mode, developer mode, click on yes. So this is the second step. Once it is done, now open run, the shortcut is windows plus R. So here search for optional features dot exe. So you can see this particular windows feature prompt. So here you need to enable windows subsystem for Linux. Check this box, click on OK. So this particular settings are getting applied now. So it is asking you to reboot your PC. Now you need to click on restart now. So once after my system gets restart, I will explain you next step. Once after restarting your system, try to open Ubuntu. So installing, this may take few minutes. So some of the features are getting updated now. So the next step is enter new Unix username. You need to put some username here. I'm giving my username as TMSY. Click on enter. Now type your password. While typing your password, it will be in hidden mode. So simply type and click on enter. Retype the same password again. Click on enter. So the installation is completed. You can see here TMSY is the username. So let us put some random commands here. PWD, present working directory. So the present working directory is home TMSY. CD dot dot. So go one step backward. Type ls hyphen a. So all these are the list of directories which are present in your Ubuntu. So this is how you will install Ubuntu in Windows by means of Microsoft Store.